chances are you know about Ohio State football. And you've probably even heard of Duke basketball. But if you're more of a gearhead than you're a stick and ball person, then you need to know about the Formula and Baja SAE teams competing on the campuses around the world. Fortunately for us, we had a chance to host four of them here in our Summit Racing Ohio retail store. The Formula and Baja SAE programs challenge students to conceive, design, fabricate, and compete with small formula-style racing cars or off-road vehicles. The teams compete at events in a series of static and dynamic challenges and are judged in categories like cost and presentation. So I found out about the program uh, just through campus tours, and when I realized how competitive Akron's team was, uh, that's how I decided I wanted to go to Akron. And I moved into my dorm, and pretty much before day one of classes, I was already in, in the shop working on stuff. They had a wrench in my hands and put me to work. Well, I've been into cars forever and wanted to be an engineer, so I think this is like a really cool place where you get to fly what you're learning in school to like an actual real thing that you can build. Just manufacturing all the components and seeing it come together is really cool, but it's just something totally different when you actually have a chassis on a table and you start putting suspension, get a rolling chassis, and it's like, Hey, we're building a race car here. It was a good year where in my freshman year, I was just learning by fixing up this car, working on it, understanding the old designs and trying to fix some of those old designs for a year with some of the more senior members. And then we got to take it to Arizona where we actually had pretty good success. I, I, the thing I was most proud of was we were able to get 10th place in the suspension test there, which was really good for us. So this year we're doing all wheel drive with the planetary gearbox in each corner. It's gonna be a full carbon monocoque, full aero package, the whole thing. It's pretty awesome. We're excited. In terms of making our car this year, we kind of just wanted to do as well everything as possible. So that meant increasing suspension travel, making our own custom CVT over the uh, gauge CVT that we used in the past, and then also just like making everything as robust and reliable as possible. The planetary gearbox is all just student designed, and then we have companies that'll help us machine the gears. But, you know, at the end of the day, it's us designing it and putting it together. It's just a little harder because I'm in that engineering mindset, you know. I'm, I want to build things. So I have to take a step back and understand the business side of does it make sense to build this? What does it cost to build? How do I sell this? Which doesn't immediately seem important, but as I've learned more through internships, it's actually a really important aspect of engineering I kind of put off. The biggest thing that I've learned is just how important it is to work as a team and kind of keep the communication up because you know if you're falling behind in one area there's tons of people that are able to help you out and that's honestly you know when I was brakes lead and I would help out the chassis lead with a lot of stuff that's how I learned the most is just getting that cross disciplinary knowledge between the systems so it's I guess don't be afraid to get your hands dirty with things you don't understand. So um, that car behind me competed in all three 2024 competitions. So I went to California, Pennsylvania, and Michigan. So in California, we got ninth place overall. And then Michigan and Pennsylvania, we got sixth place overall. There's usually over 100 teams there, so we're pretty happy with that. Um, it got first place acceleration in all three events, which is really cool. And then it did get first place dynamic day in California as well, which we're really happy with. So Akron's one of the only teams that we go overseas for our competitions. So we usually go to uh, Austria, Hungary, Germany, Czech Republic, Spain, you name it. We've probably been there and we've probably got top 10 when we did it. It's a super competitive program. There's just a lot of great knowledge transfer from year to year. The tradition of Akron is the team that goes to Europe is really one of the coolest things. I think if you have a deadline, double it and that's probably when it'll actually get done by it never seems to get done when i think it's going to get done by even when i have all the resources and everything it's just everything takes time and it, it's hard to rush good engineering i guess